Kaplan here, and I'm joined by Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sidelines. We've got the Los Angeles Lakers facing the Golden State Warriors. It'll be Los Angeles off the tip. And now the Lakers starting group. We've got Baylor. Barnett is out there with West. And it's LaRusso. And it's Johnson in its center. Here's Baylor. And he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact. And he'll go to the line for two. And, you know, beyond all the things Baylor gives you, he's an entertainer out on the floor. The acrobatics we see. Something spectacular from this guy almost every game. So he gets them both. Here's Curry. Pass to Chris. Wiggins against Baylor. And good, and it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. Razor sharp focus from the young fella, Andrew Wiggins there, not allowing the defense to bother him. Curry against Barnett. Out to the wing. Lakers working the ball around now. Six to shoot. And there's the call on Clay Thompson. That is his first foul of the game. And that's a quick foul for him there. Looks like the refs are going to call this one pretty close. Barnett passes to LaRusso. To the left wing. Pass to Barnett. And it's out of bounds. The Lakers able to retain possession here. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. Just take a look at the range of Jerry West. And here's Curry who brings it up for Golden State. It's a three-point game. Now the pass to Chris. Here's Thompson. Here's Baylor. Chris with the rebound. Thompson for three. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. LaRusso, good D by Thompson. You know, currently they're just one of five from the field. That's not going to get it done. Curry kicks to Chris over Johnson. That one a little long. We're just about two minutes into the first quarter. Barnett passes to LaRusso. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And guys, there's a reason they call him Roughhouse Rudy. Every time we see LaRusso, there's a toughness that he'll bring to the game. He doesn't get the second one. To the middle. And Chris throws it down. Staying alert and aware. Wiggins sees his man flash to an open spot. Passes right on the money. West against Curry. Pass to Barnett. Trying to get open is Johnson. Barnett, no good. And so Curry will bring it up for Golden State. They trail by one. Thompson, and no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. The defense ready for him on that possession. They had to be because he is so strong in the paint. Great positioning on the putback. Wow, what, what you can do when you're that strong and graceful. Just tremendous hang time for a big man. And, of course, Baylor converts a lot of those second chance opportunities. Curry gets the bucket. And hitting the mid-range jumper here early gives the defense just another thing to think about. Well, they better be thinking about him. I mean, we know how dangerous he is. Barnett. LaRusso. Andrew Wiggins pulls it in. And so here is Golden State. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Well, Kevin, Los Angeles' head coach gave me a few minutes. One player he's focused on slowing down is Clay Thompson. We all know he can heat up in a hurry, so coach wants them to stay in his hip pocket and contest the catch and try to keep the ball out of his hands 
before he shoots. Kevin? Thank you, David. Wiggins with the block. Great read that time by Wiggins, anticipating the shot. Sends it out with return to sender posted. Uh, you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. Well, you know, I hear you. That's a good look, but when you're that wide open, I think you got to knock it down. Here's Barnett. No points in the game yet for him. Well, just cannot buy a bucket, guys. I'll tell you what, that's a painful quarter for him, and it's painful for me to watch, too. The Lakers in the lead. Johnson at the elbow. And it's Marquise Chris with the foul. That is his first foul of the game. And now only one away from being in the penalty. Yep, the next one puts them on the line, so they've got to be careful the rest of the way. The Warriors making a switch here. Looney's checked in. West outside. Shot clock at six. There is that fast release from West. Watch out now. When this guy gets into a rhythm, it is something to behold. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Here's Wiggins. Oh. Oh. Typically an efficient ball handler using only what he needs. Wiggins with the savage move that time. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. And it's tied up with that one. The Lakers with the ball. Here's Barnett. With the teardrop. But he gets it back. Baylor drives in. It's going to be out of bounds. Los Angeles will retain possession. Clock at four. Tries again. Well, he has not been sharp this period. Seems to be a little flustered out there, too. And there's the whistle. Screen. Illegal screen. Uh, beyond the leaning, you could see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. Yeah, I agree. You know, sometimes that can be a tough call for the refs to make, but not that time. It was easy there. Harris has checked in for the Lakers. Curry on the wing. Defended by West. Green left side. Johnson with the block. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Johnson. Here's Pascal. Curry with a wide open look. Buries it from three-point range. Curry's got five. And Kevin, the three ball of Curry deadly. I mean, you feel like it's going in as soon as he lets it go, no matter where, at what angle or how deep. Pretty early to be over the limit. That foul situation is something we want to keep an eye on. For Los Angeles, they have split their free throws right down the middle so far. They're two for two. And both free throws good for West. And what an advantage. You really feel like you can always trust him when he's at the line. West against Curry. Got a piece of it. Five on the clock. That shot, no good. West with some nice D. Here's Baylor. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. You know, the power and grace of Elgin Baylor, just too much to handle. This time he draws the foul. And the first one drops. Damian Lee, he's checked in for Thompson. And the Lakers also making a change. Nelson's checked in. They should be in front right now, but he'll be relieved not to have come up totally empty there. Pass to Poole. Passes it to Looney. Shoots from the block. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. And boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. West right side. Lee with the steal. And up the court come the Warriors on the break. Good work defensively by Baylor. And not allowing the shooter 
even an inch of breathing room on that one. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high-impact defense they want to see out of him. Boy, that was a pretty assist by Harris. Curry against West, and they call an illegal screen. Right. I think he has to play more conservative from this point on. I mean, that's two fouls already. Brown is checked in for Los Angeles. And here is Los Angeles now. Left side, Harris. And the pass to West. Down low. Here's LaRusso. The shot's good on the assist by West. And the Lakers lead by two. Well, you know, Kevin, because the defense pays so much attention to West, his teammates can find a lot of open spaces. Back to Curry. Master Looney poked loose and stolen by Harris. Nelson looking around. Curry against West. Back to Nelson. It's blocked. Curry with it. He's got five. Yeah, Curry is so impressive. His peripheral vision is what makes him unique in addition to his ball handling skills. He does a nice job setting up his teammates and knows how to get them the ball when they're open. And so it's West with it. He brings it up for the Lakers. The feed to Nelson. Pass to LaRusso. And there it is for him. LaRusso's got his second basket. And they're passing the ball very crisply here. Here's Curry. And the Warriors tack on two more. And Curry calling for the pick and roll and running it with precision. He is a terrific floor general. He knows how to strike the soft spot of an opposing defense. And Looney sends it back. And up the court come the Warriors on the break. Another three for Golden State. Well, he's just zoned in. I mean, in most cases, taking quality shots very much within the flow of the offense. Harris dishes to Nelson. Kicks it to Brown. West up on top. Guarded by Kirk. Rocket six. West passes to Harris. He feeds it to Nelson. It's blocked. And they'll turn it over. Could not get off his shot before second violation. Clay Thompson, he's checked in for the Warriors. Warriors leading by three. Guy is a potent offense right now. You know what, guys? And they're playing with a certain amount of assuredness in their game. That type of confidence is what leads teams to having success. One-on-one -on -one here is LaRusso. And then LaRusso with the dunk. Well, if you don't take care of the ball, fellas, that's what can happen. Absolutely, Greg. That makes the turnover even more painful. What? You, you mean the throwdown at the end? I'll tell you what, fellas. I mean, the highlight shows are going to pain them even more. And he just hasn't been able to make anything this quarter. For Los Angeles, they have shot five of eight from the foul line. A free throw drops for West. And, and you look at all the things this man brings to the game the focus the resolve a winner's mindset i mean there's a reason why they call him the logo green he's checked in for the warriors smith checked in for los angeles and that'll be two free throws coming up officials on the call with the foul all oh, the, the officials are all over that one clearly a foul i mean didn't give him any choice but to blow the whistle i mean you got to play without foul when he keeps his emotions in check, Green is a fantastic leader on the court. He can run a little hot, but there's no doubting his drive, his willingness to do whatever it takes to win. Now here's West. He's got 11. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. And you know, guys, I love his fight and grit on the interior. I mean, he never lets a shot go uncontested. 104 left to play in the first. Here's Thompson. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that cold streak. And he's got to find other ways to contribute then because his shot making is not happening right now. Now, here's Thompson. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Watch the pick. Over Harris. 
It's good from the top of the key. And the Warriors lead by three. West against Thompson. Left side, West. To the left side wing. Six to shoot. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And it goes on Draymond Green. The Lakers have shot 70% from the free throw line tonight. Seven for ten. And he makes the first, but misses the second. It's Thompson off the drive. That shot is off. Smith fires from way outside. One quarter in the books, and it's been a close one so far. The Warriors on top. They lead by two. And back with the start of the second quarter in just a moment. Some good action already in this one, but a fairly even matchup after the first quarter of play. And the Warriors, guys, what jumps out to you in this game, uh, stats one. What we saw in that first quarter, uh, they won their matchups defensively. Yeah, I agree. I mean, you, you look at the energy, the effort defensively, they put it all out there in that opening quarter. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor, all fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. Taking a look at the Lakers. LaRusso is out there with Nelson. Lynch Smith. Then it's Devin Harris. And it's West in at the point guard position. Here's West. The Warriors making the shot. Passes it to LaRusso. And then LaRusso with the dunk. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Somebody you can count on. He is an extremely reliable finisher. Now here's Lee. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Here's Pascal. Guarded by Nelson. Had a hand on it. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Well, Kevin, the Warriors may have some injuries that they're going to deal with this season, but they're going to do it in a dynamic new building, Chase Center in San Francisco. The more than one billion, that's with a B, dollar arena, is hopefully going to generate revenue for the team off the floor and allow them to keep some great players in uniform on the floor. It's going to be state of the art here in Golden State as the team moves from Oakland after spending more than four decades playing at Oracle Arena. D.A., as you and I were talking, they hate to leave where they've been so successful in Oakland, but this building, this building is amazing. Thank you. So both teams changing it up here. And there's the pass to Wiggins. Smith with it, now defended by Wiggins. Throws down the breakaway jam gotta take care of the ball they'll punish you uh -huh. if you're that careless that's right and that's severe punishment right there exactly i mean when you're running neck to neck those kinds of mistakes tip the scales you, you almost have to assume he's going to knock those down when he is that open and harris wide open he shoots buries the long-range jumper now it's a seven-point laker lead Curry against Harris. To halt the run. And it's Stephen Curry with a three. Curry's got 13. And that gets him going here in the second after hitting two from long range in that first. Harris passes to LaRusso. Raymond Green grabs the miss. Green's got four rebounds now tonight. Wiggins. And it's Wiggins with the jam. Well, that was quality defense, but Wiggins showing off tremendous athleticism, able to overcome that defense. Harris looking it over. Here in the second quarter, about three minutes played. Pass to LaRusso. And that one is off. 
So Golden State will take it the other way. Thompson outside. And he makes that one. Thompson's got the game tied up here for the Warriors. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Barnett against Curry. Green with the block. Green takes great pride in his defense now. He loves the nine shots at the rim and playing bigger than his 6'8 frame would lead you to believe. Barnett against Thompson. On the wing, Wiggins. He has seven. And it's Green missing. And here are the Lakers. Here's Barnett. And the Lakers with another miss. Curry against LaRusso. Back to Green. Chris pass to Thompson. Rejected by Harris. Smith outside. Pass to LaRusso. They double him with Green. They need this one. And that's going to be a travel. And here's what the schedule for the Lakers looks like. On Friday, they'll be playing the Rockets in Houston. And then on Saturday... And, Kevin, I think you have to look at this as an opportunity to take a step forward. Sometimes tough road trips can bring the best out of a team and bring you closer together. Feeds to Thompson. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Curry's got three assists tonight. It's such a smart pass from Curry. There isn't much this guy can't do with the ball in his hands. He sees the whole court. Green against LaRusso. Trying to get open is Johnson, and he overdid it there. Too much force looked like on the foul, and he's called for the flagrant. Boy, a, a very hard foul that time, and the officials had to slap him with the flagrant. I mean, you can't let him get away with that kind of contact. Yeah, gee, that's an easy call for the officials to make when there's that much contact. The league is really cracking down on those sort of plays. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. Both teams will make substitutions. Harris up top, guarded by Kerr. Here's Baylor. It's good, only a few seconds into the shot clock. Baylor's got seven points. And what's unique about Baylor, he can score from a variety of angles and really good off of either shoulder. Just great extension and body control. Trains the three-pointer. He's going to force them to have to make adjustments. That's number four in terms of triples in the half. Three on three. Here's Chris, and Chris throws it down. And once Chris gets the position he wants, he is throwing it down with a vengeance. Harris against Curry. Harris, right side. Shot clock at six. Shoots from 14. Got a piece of it. And here we go with Curry running it up the court. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Drawing contact on the dribble drive there. Wiggins with the quick first step. Forcing the issue offensively and as a result, draws the foul. Brown is checked in for Barnett. A look from Harris. Los Angeles with another miss. And it's the Warriors ball. They're on a 15-4 run. Green, no luck. Lakers trail by four. Harris passes to Baylor. The 10-footer. And that one goes long. And being that close to the hoop, I thought he had enough room to finish that one. On its way from Curry for two. Got it. Number seven on the night. Seven for 11 from the floor. Well, they're really making a point of keeping the ball moving around. Time out, time That's out. the key. The D can't focus on one player. And no matter what anybody tells you, that ball will always move quicker than the defender. So timeout called here. The first for Los Angeles. Curry with a strong contribution so far in this one. You know, that defense is helpless right now. I mean, he's got their number and he knows it. And the Lakers making a change here. Williams is checked in. Hey, 
on the wing, Brown. Brown outside. Four on the clock. Here's Harris. And it's out of bounds. The Lakers able to retain possession here. Here's Baylor. He has seven. Oof. Ugly second quarter for him. And now I think he's starting to really force the issue. Back to Curry. And it's stolen by Brown. And it's the Lakers on the break. Here's Baylor. And they get it. And Rooney sends it back. Second shot opportunity. And contact on the shot. So he'll be shooting free throws here. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. The hustle stats for the Warriors. Well, in the first half of play, they're closing out aggressively, blocking shots. A key indicator of their activity on the defensive side. Yeah, another thing they've done well, guys. A lot of steals in the first half. Really getting after it defensively. That free throw missing. He hits the second from the line. And it's Curry with the ball, bringing it up for the Golden State Warriors. Leading by five. Inside and stolen by Williams. Now the Lakers on the break. And Elgin Baylor, the bucket on the assist by Williams. Baylor's got his third bucket of the night. You gotta love his hustle, leaving the defense no time to react. And you know you're gonna get those buckets, guys, when you're quick to get out on the break. Get that ball up the court as fast as you can. Here's Poole, still looking for his first bucket in this one. Four on the shot clock. Curry can't get it to go. Lakers trail by three. Williams passes to Baylor. He takes the elbow jumper and trains it. Baylor's got 11 points. And he should thank the team for those two points. Nobody paid much attention to him on that play. Curry kicks it to Looney. That shot off. Good work defensively by Baylor. Brown outside. Finish off the break. And the Lakers lead by one. Oh, nice setup by Baylor. Man, this guy can pass, shoot, rebound. Anything you need, he's there to provide. Now here's Curry. 18 points for him. And on an open look like that, he's very gifted at making the weak coverage pay. It's rebounded by Poole. Curry against Harris. And here is Curry. To the paint. Here's Pascal. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. Definitely saved the layup with that foul. And he'll make him earn him from the line. And that's what you want to see. Clay Thompson, he's checked in for Curry. And then for Los Angeles, Nelson comes in for Brown. And West subs in for Devin Harris. Higgins outside. It's deflected. And the foul on Andrew Wiggins. And that'll be his third foul so far. Here are the Lakers with the ball. West outside. Here's Baylor. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Wiggins has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. 153 left now here in the second. Thompson in the corner. And he gets it to go from the corner. Thompson's got eight. Gotta love the smooth shooting stroke of Thompson. Outstanding. And shooting as soon as he catches the ball. West passes to Williams. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. No question about it, Greg. I mean, a ton of contact and a good call by the official. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. 124 left in the first half of basketball. 
Thompson looking for an opening. Passes to Looney. Golden State needs to get off a shot. Basket counts. And the Warriors lead by two. Seems to have a knack for hitting guys in their spots. His vision, excellent. Here's the pass to Baylor. And they double up Baylor. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. So it's the Lakers now. Nelson dishes to West. West draws the double. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. You two players. The Lakers with the ball. Baylor kicks to Brown. Six on the shot clock. West passes to Baylor. A power dunk by Elgin Baylor. Yeah, an explosive athlete, the precursor to the high flyers, prone to the spectacular Baylor with a strong move. Here's Poole. Pass to Thompson. Ring shot on the way. A second chance effort. And it's sent back by West. To the inside. Elgin Baylor throwing it down again. Fundamentals, guys, using the one-hand slam. Well, he makes the basics look pretty exceptional. And, Kevin, I'd suggest that he stay with those basics because we've got a tight one here tonight. And a close game so far through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Lakers on top as they end the second quarter with a 13-5 run. It's the NBA on 2K Sports. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Greetings to each and every one of you watching at this very moment. Uh, I'm Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is here. Shaq is here. One half is behind us. Welcome to the 2K Sports Halftime Show. A competitive matchup for the Lakers in the first quarter. Some good moments from both teams, but as the first period wrapped up, they trailed by two. They battled hard in the second quarter, and it was reflected on the scoreboard. And let's get your thoughts, Kenny, on the Lakers. Well, they're doing a great job of pushing the action and getting to the foul line. They aren't just pulling up for uncontested shots. They're making the defense react to them. In transition, on the dribble, and with those quick cuts, they're in attack mode. That's dangerous. To beat them, you need to force them to play more defensively. Shaq, how'd you think the Warriors were playing? I was surprised at some of the recklessness. They were scattered, sloppy ball handling, just too many turnovers. It gets back to fundamentals. Forget the highlight real pass, but the effective one. Simple bounce pass. John Wooden taught us that in the 40, 30, 50, whenever he was coaching. Just play under control. Simple ball, dude. And that wraps up the halftime show. Third quarter set to begin in just a few. Second half of basketball upon us. We may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game it's been so far. Curry has been sensational. And if he can keep shooting from deep like he did in the first half, he's going to be more than a handful. Yeah, you know what? The defense is going to adjust. They'll be ready for him now, so I'm sure they talked a lot about how to slow him down. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. Curry and Clay, the Splash Brothers, in the backcourt. Wiggins is out there with Draymond Green, and it's Chris in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. That's the Warriors' five. Young, rangy big man. Chris possesses a nice skill set, and I think the potential to be a terrific player in our league. And so he hits both. And among NBA bigs, he is known for his ability to deliver at the free throw line. Pass to Barnett. Let's it go from 11. Here's Johnson. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. 
It's going to be on Andrew Wiggins. And he makes the first. Second free throw, no good. Yeah, disappointing not to convert all of them, but he did get the one to give them the lead. Boy, Curry is so creative and efficient, and when he gets hot and gets going, he rains down points and baskets on the defense. Barnett passes to Johnson. Here's LaRusso. As we approach the fourth quarter, still anyone's ballgame. Yeah, neither team able to create much of a cushion. Curry against West. On the wing, Thompson. From deep. It's rebounded by LaRusso. Russo's got his sixth rebound on the night. Passes it to Barnett. Now West. Curry with the steal. He kicks it to Thompson. Rebounded by the Lakers. Russo's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. And, Greg, we've seen it time and time again in games. Effort and determination on the glass can make up for a lot of other weaknesses. Outside West. Great tee that time from Green. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. Yeah, these defenders had better start closing down on shooting. West draws the double inside. It's stolen by Green. Here's Wiggins. Oh, oh that oh. was worth the price of admission. Making the impossible look easy. Wiggins with the great creativity in the air. He typically hangs in the air a little longer than the average bird, though. Lakers trail by seven. Over to the left wing. Russo, the pass to Baylor. And West now, top of the key. The pass to Barnett. Down to five on the shot clock. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. Shot to stop the run. Los Angeles with another miss. Ooh, and this is turning into a slow start here in the second half. Seems like they left that offense in the locker room. Man, Thompson is phenomenal as a two-way player. A knockdown shooter from everywhere, challenged or unchallenged. And he defends at an elite level, too. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Clock keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. Los Angeles calls timeout. As the teams head into this timeout, a chance for the coaches now to map out some plays for the next few minutes and a chance for the players to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's important if they want to make sure they don't wear down later in the game. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, you have to stay hydrated. To the left wing. Here's West. A shot that time. Not on target. AT that time from Curry. No matter what looks they get, they just can't convert to stop this run. And, you know, they've got to be careful because this is when the team concept breaks down and guys start playing hero ball. And it's Chris in the corner. Puts up a three. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Curry's got six assists now in the game. All these threes they're giving up have really been the driving force on this run. Lakers trail by 12. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Boy, that's a nice looking stroke, isn't it, Kevin? From the mid-range area, shoulder squared, elbow in perfect alignment, follow through. Jerry West, picture perfect. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. West has got 16 points. Doing all he can so far, but they still find themselves trailing. It's Curry outside. It's rebounded by Baylor. Baylor's got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. Johnson inside. Working on Chris. Here's Barnett. Fall back, baby. Dick Barnett with the pretty J. Warriors leading by six. And some changes here for the Lakers. Smith comes in for LaRusso. And Harris subbed in for Barnett. Bowman fended by West. Down low. Pass to Bowman. Shot clock at six. 
A shot by Thompson, and no one's around. A tad short, but it's good off the front iron. Lakers trail by eight. West passes to Smith. Back to West. Green with the rebound. And the activity he shows around the rim is why he is such a respected defender. And you know what? He's not going to give up an easy finish at the rim. I mean, that's just uh, against his constitution. Here's Wiggins. And Wiggins throws it down hard. Oh, I like that effort from Andrew Wiggins there. Doing a nice job on the offensive glass. Here's West. 16 points for him. The 19-foot shot. There's the deadly jump shot of the great Jerry West. Warriors leading by eight. Now here's Wiggins. 12 points for him. No good there. And after defending on the shot, he doesn't give up on the play. Follow that straight to the glass for the rebound. And didn't do anything fancy there, but didn't need to. Nope. He, his only concern right now is getting the points on the board. And I, I don't mean style points. Hey, I thought there was some style there, guys. What are you guys looking at? I mean, it was still a pretty sweet, flavorful one-hand flush. One-on-one -on -one here. Harris's shot is off. West against Wiggins. And it's Wiggins with the jam. And there you go. Monster finish. Wiggins aggressive, attacking off the dribble. Smith outside. It's West with the drive. It's deflected, and it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Green. Brown is checked in for the Lakers. Harris outside. Elgin Baylor on the wing. Five to shoot. He's off on that one. Wiggins with some nice D. Warriors leading by eight. And block. That one goes careening off the glass. And so it's Smith with it. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. And he makes good on the layup. Hey, guys, the D has to show a little more fight on the interior than they did on that trip. Outside Curry. Goes up on the high post. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Curry's got 25 points in the game. Man, he's having quite the quarter, converting at a really high percentage. Here's Baylor. <laughs> And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And now we'll get a perspective here on the hustle game, how it's been going for the Warriors. Contested shots and block shots. They're bread and butter defensively. They're giving up no easy looks. And, and also, how about the points they've gotten in transition or on the fast break tonight? That's been a huge factor as well. Nelson's checked in for Johnson. Riggins outside. Another one in the scoring column for him. He's 7 of 10 from the field. Off the dribble drive, Wiggins gets a step. Hard to get in front of him after that. Elgin Baylor on the wing. And they double up Baylor. Here's Harris. And that one, good. Harris has got 7. And that's what you want to see. Good fundamental sound basketball with the bounce pass. Pass to Curry. Let's it go. And there are the Warriors now with another bucket. And I have great appreciation for the IQ of Stephen Curry. I mean, once the ball hits his hands, guys, you know he's thinking about letting it go. Here's Baylor over in the corner. Brown. Left side, Harris. Stolen. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. And when you see Wiggins starting to develop that mindset, that mental edge, knows he has the defender in trouble, and he's able to draw the foul as a result. 
The Lakers making a switch here. Brown's checked in. Right side, Baylor. And the dunk by Baylor. Well, I tell you what, once Baylor gets into a groove the way he has tonight, he can absolutely carry the load on offense. He's had six attempts at the line, made five of them. Warriors leading by seven. Outside curve. Over in the corner, Looney. To the paint. And it's blocked by Brown. Begins with the block. The second effort. It's going to be out of bounds. Los Angeles will retain possession. Baylor kicks to Harris. Goes back up. And you know what? He's just not on his game. No doubt about it. Their deficit isn't totally on him. But he has not been an asset for his team. Second chance shot. And gets hacked by the D. He'll go to the line. Free throw good from Baylor. The Warriors making a switch here. Thompson's checked in. And so Baylor nails both of them. And they are making it look easy at the free throw line here in the second half. Bowman guarded by Harris. Curry. Nice shot from the wing. Curry's got 11 here in this quarter alone. Monster quarter for him. He's put the team on his back trying to carry them to the W. First one falls for him. And Harris does a really good job using his quickness to his advantage. And he's got plenty of that quickness. A creative guard who plays with an edge, too. Williams, he's checked in for the Lakers. The feed to Green. Here's Poole. He's guarded by Williams. Poole, the pass to Green. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Impeccable from the line since halftime. No misses yet. You can't do much better than that, guys. He hits one, then misses the second attempt from the free throw line. Lakers trail by six. Passes it to Baylor. Pulls up on the elbow. They get it back. Williams kicks to Nelson. To the middle. Tries again. Tries yet again. Baylor once again going strong to the hoop. And really the scoring this quarter has been just off the charts. Doing all he can to bring them back. Warriors leading by four. 105 left in the third. Green in the post. Guarded by Harris. Shots good by Green. And not quite as aggressive from outside as they were in the first half. Sticking to the high percentage shots. Playing smart with the lead. Harris dishes to Baylor. That one no good. Great T that time from Green. And that one is hammered home. And you know for a big man I think Green is one of the better dime droppers in the league. I mean he's a true point forward who has excellent vision and sees the floor well. Harris passes to Baylor. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And it goes on Draymond Green. Yeah, easy call. Yeah, you can hear the smack all the way over here where we are. And Los Angeles with some changes. Russo's checked in for Nelson. And it's Barnett in for Harris. The Warriors leading. There's a four-second difference from the shot clock to the game clock. Green. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Brown drives in. It's rebounded by Golden State. I think he'll think twice about attempting that shot next time. The defense was right on top of him there. With the floater, it's tipped. And the wide open shot from Green. Oh, and he nails it just in time. One eye on the rim, one on the clock. What a play. An ideal way to end the quarter with momentum on your side.
And so it's the Golden State Warriors with a 10-point lead, some breathing room heading into the break. They've been playing some ferocious defense. And we've got more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way after this break. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. And how about the big fella here showing us he's got some point guard skill here with the tremendous setup. Hey, that was a high-level pass no matter what position it came from. But it does make it stand out a little more when it's made by the big fella. And with three quarters behind us, let's see what this fourth period holds in store for us. So for the Lakers right now, on out there with LaRusso, then there's West, then it's Williams, and it's Barnett in at the two. Warriors leading by eight. Here's Poole. He's guarded by LaRusso. And Green gets it to go. Yeah, the first half was one to deep six or forget, but in the second half, He's looked a lot better. Barnett passes to LaRusso, and the shot is good. LaRusso's got four points now in the quarter. I love the spirit he's shown tonight, particularly on the offensive end. Boy, I tell you what, the hole would be a lot deeper if he wasn't being as efficient as he's been so far. And as a team, they're hovering around the high 80s from the free throw line. They've gotten better as the game has gone along, which is exactly what you want to see. Johnson, he's checked in for Brown. And making the most of their opportunities at the line here in the second half. A pass to Barnett. Fourth quarter, still young, just over a minute play. And then LaRusso with the dunk. And when he's on the floor, offensive rebounding is always going to be a strength for them. Greg, he keeps so many possessions alive, doesn't he? And, you know, those second-chance opportunities can be game-changing. He represents so much value to this team because of what he does. Lock at six. Thompson right side over Williams. And he sinks that one, hitting the back of the rim on the way in. And that's now 17 points for Clay Thompson. West outside. Pulls up. High post. That shot misses. The Warriors go the other way with it. Thompson for the triple. Drills the three-pointer. Thompson's got the lead up to 13 now for the Warriors. And that's his second triple of the half. None for him going into the break. Pass to LaRusso. Green with the block. On the wing, Thompson. Rob. Pass to West. That's tipped. Thompson outside. This one for three. Another three for Golden State. It's been this way since halftime. Tremendous production from beyond the arc. Well, it's been a three-point barrage. They came out gunning and have not stopped. And the Lakers call time here. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, and you know, that's going to be the focus of this timeout. They need to come up with a spark to get the offense going. The Lakers making a switch here. Smith has checked in. Warriors on D. 16-point lead, the largest margin in the game. Here's LaRusso. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Thompson. And just about three minutes through the fourth quarter here. He's been ice cold tonight. And, you know, you look at the scoreboard guys, they really could have used this contribution. 
Mark, it feels like we're seeing more and more of this, but bench celebrations and reactions at both college and pro level. Yeah, you know what, Kevin? I think it's an outgrowth of the social media. I, you're right. I agree. I think there's no question because <laughs> the, anything that can be done that's creative and fun is going to find a life on social media and maybe go viral. And guys know that. They're aware. I mean, this generation has grown up with social media. So they understand that they could be seen beyond just the arena if they do something pretty clever. And you and I are sitting over here watching it. We're laughing as much as anybody else, aren't we? Oh, I'm not denying that it's fun. I love seeing it, actually. <laughs> but on occasion, it does get a little carried away. Here's West. And he really seems to just have lost his touch at halftime. And up the court come the Warriors on the break. Curry and leading the charge. To the inside. It's tipped. Looney, two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Yeah, and their free throw shooting has really improved here in the second half. And that one falls for Looney. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Regarding super teams, Clark, you and I have talked a lot about this. Many fans view them in a negative light, but they're actually uh, something we've seen around in this game for a long time. Yeah, you're right. So often we become prisoners of the present and we forget about what transpired in the past with the Celtics in the 60s were as dominant as any team in the history of the game. The Lakers in the 80s, the Bulls in the 90s. But I guess fans have a complaint because they feel those teams came together more organically compared to what seems to be a movement by free agents that has led to dominant championship teams. Although the Warriors pretty much have built their championship team through the draft. And taken away by Johnson. Unhindered, going all the way. Good job getting the ball and completing that play. Boy, there's not much defense available once a steal is made. That's the best time to attack on the break. Back to Curry. They double-team Curry. And the turnover again by Golden State. You know, I think he may have forced that pass when there was really no reason to. Brown is checked in for the Lakers. And so it's West with it. He brings it up for the Lakers. Passes it to LaRusso. It's rebounded by Golden State. Looney's got four rebounds now tonight. Here's Curry with the three. And the Warriors miss again. Lakers trail by 16. And there's the call on Klay Thompson. And that'll be his third foul so far. Green, he's checked in for the Warriors. Wiggins comes in for Thompson. Barnett passes to LaRusso. Dishes it to Brown. He feeds it to West. Six to shoot. From deep three-point range, and no good. Curry with the defensive effort. Lee kicks to Curry. Now a timeout called by Golden State. And Kevin, they've been committing a lot of turnovers here. Taking care of the basketball is the number one priority right now in that huddle. They've got to tighten it up. The Warriors making a switch here. The high post shot. The rebound by Johnson. Johnson's got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. There's LaRusso. Goes back up. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Yeah, I think they've got to ramp up the aggressiveness, Greg. I mean, if they don't, things are just going to get worse from here. Baylor, he's checked in for Brown. Warriors leading by 13. Curry finds Green. Green. 
Back to Curry. They kick it out to Green. Just four to shoot. No good. And they can't put an end to this drought. Lakers trail by 13. Now the Lakers on the break. Shooting foul. As the whistle blows, he'll shoot two free throws. No question he got bumped on that shot. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. Harris has checked in for Barnett. And so LaRusso nails them both. Here's Curry. Wiggins outside. And Wiggins throws it down hard. Inviting contact on the drive. Wiggins with the aggressive move. Pays off there. And here is Los Angeles now. It's a 13-point game. Harris passes to West. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. And the first one at the line is good. Marquis Chris, he's checked in for the Warriors. Clay Thompson comes in for Lee. And both free throws good for West. Warriors leading by 11. Now Curry. At the elbow, it's Wiggins. Shot clock at five. Good work defensively by Baylor. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. And you know what, guys? That will pump him up because he takes a ton of pride in what he does on defense. Curry against West. Puts it up from 15. Uses the glass to drop it in. Curry's got 13 points here in the second half alone. Lakers trail by 11. To the right side. 16 feet away. Another shot. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And he can't get the first one. Timeout called the Warriors. And they're committing an awful lot of fouls here. And not of the good variety. You don't want to give up easy layups. Sure, but it's been a non-stop parade to the foul line. And now let's present our Jordan player of the game, Steph Curry. And guys, he's been about as close to perfection as you can be. The intensity he's played with has been amazing. Just no let up. And as fired up as he's been, he's never let his emotions get out of control. He sure has given this crowd a treat tonight. This kind of performance only cements his status as a fan favorite. And on our sideline, our reporter, David Aldridge. Thanks, Kevin. Will Steve Kerr talk to his team during the break? He told them, look, we're in a good spot. The one thing I want you guys to do, stay in the moment. Don't look ahead. Stay in the moment and compete. Kevin will see if they can keep focused. And the call is going to be, yes, yes it is, an illegal screen. And not the most common call you'll see in the NBA, but hard to argue that pick wasn't illegal. Yeah, you know, the officials aren't nearly as lenient as they used to be on that call. As a matter of fact, I know I got away with a lot of those in my playing days, but that was 40 years ago. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. On the wing, Thompson. Rebound by Johnson. Here are the Lakers. They're on a 16-4 run right now. And it's blocked. Thompson outside. And again, no good by Golden State. This shot's just, it's not there right now. With this team leading, perhaps, you know, let's focus on some other areas of the game. LaRusso, no good. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Golden State Warriors. They led the game at one point by 20 to the paint. It's stolen by Johnson. Outside Baylor. Warriors with the rebound. 
Wiggins has got eight rebounds in this game. Outside Curry. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. I mean, I think Curry could shoot his free throws blindfolded and still make about 90%. Throw good. Curry. Looney's check in for Marquis Chris. Stephen Curry hits them both. Baylor with the ball. That one, no good. Good D by Thompson. Warriors leading by 10. Rejected by Harris. And so it looks like the Warriors will retain possession here. Los Angeles making a switch here. Barnett's checked in. Curry deciding where to go with it. He gets that one. Curry's got six here in this quarter. And Curry certainly is clever and crafty. Trickery is part of his arsenal when he gets inside. I mean, I like seeing him do his thing close to the basket. Baylor drives in. Good D by Thompson. And, and he has definitely been struggling in this quarter. You know, guys, it seems to me as though he's over anxious. He seems to be pressing, trying too hard, moving too fast. Just needs to calm himself down and wait for good shots. Taylor against Curry. Wiggins outside. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Wiggins has got 15 points here in the second half. They maintain focus all night and, and along the way put on quite a show. And, you know, everybody in the building knows this is a wrap, a done deal. Put this one in the W column. West kicks to Johnson. The pass to Baylor. Shot clock at six. To end the run. The Lakers rebound. LaRusso. Green with the block. Curry against West. Wiggins right side. For the three. And another three for Golden State. And it's just competing. You know, giving your best when it matters most. Yeah, you know, once they got victory in their view, a huge injection of energy and a great run to finish it off. Barnett against Curry. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. It was a tale of two teams tonight. One that was in total control, operating flawlessly, and the other just searching for answers that they could never find. I mean, the energy here is just so tremendous. Fans involved from the get-go, and once they started to really pour it on, it was fun to see that rhythm and flow from their perspective. That concludes the first game of the NBA season. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for being with us. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening.